Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. Let's continue the MS Excel video course tutorials. Now in this video tutorial, I will explain how to compare two columns using a conditional formatting. So let's start the tutorial. And here we got the final output of our tutorial. Notice here 23, B cell 23 is greater. That's why it's showing green color. We have applied green color if the cell contains greater value compared with C cell. Suppose if I change this one to 112 which is greater than B cell. Notice here it will become red color and this one is green color. If the cell contains same, I have given the light gray color. If I am changing this 190 to 190, see here the 190C cell is greater than B cell. That's why B cell contains the red color. If I delete and here also I delete, both cells are same. If I add 23, 45. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. For this video tutorial, I have created a new workbook called Book 1. In this Book 1, we have Sheet 1. Now, I will add some data in this B column 23, 45, 67, 99, uh, here are 96. 123, 4, uh, 45, 46, 90, 90, 90, 123, 123, 0, let's add some 48, 23. Now in the column C also I am adding some random numbers, 12, 0, 78, 6, uh, 69 99 2 89 90 56 12 and the last one I'm adding 50 now my aim is I want to apply some styles when when we comparing between B column and C column using conditional formatting for example i want to compare the column b and c if column b values is greater than c values c column values i want to display the style of the cell is green color if it's lesser when we are comparing uh, between b and c values if it's lesser i want to display the cell style is red color if both B and C cells are same. I want to display some different color, different style color using conditional formatting. So for that, uh, first the most important step is you, when we are adding conditional formatting, the rules, the rules means first we need to select this area, the range we have to select first before adding the conditional formatting. First we need to select the range then in the home tab under styles there is a conditional formatting click that one after that add new rule in the new rule tab come to the bottom one use a formula to determine which cells to format click that one after that let me move this aside so it can be visible now in the format values where this formula is true click this icon button it becomes small one now select the b2 cell so b2 cell shift up to 12 i have copied the cell i have selected the cell greater than again select the c2 cell c c2 to c12 click ok now here one most important step is dollar b and dollar 2 here so delete the dollar sign from the row so we just need dollar b2 only here also dollar b2 the cell name is dollar c2 and dollar c2 
After that, let's apply some format. Go to format in the format cells. The last tab is fill. In the fill, fill effects I have selected. Color 2, I want to display greater because I want to uh, apply the cell color, background color, green color when, uh, when we have the greater value compared with C cell. Click OK. 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 So notice here we got the green colors wherever we have greater value compared with C value, C cell values. Now again I have selected this same cells. Go to conditional formatting. Now again I am adding new rule. Select this user format to determine. Again click this one. Now select B2 cell. Control to uh, not control B2 cell shift shift to C2 B2 hour. Now this time lesser. I'm comparing the C2 to C2 hour. Expand this window. Now delete this one. We like just require dollar B2. Don't use keys arrow keys here. Use the mouse on. Otherwise the form the rule will change. C2 and C12. Don't use arrows, the formula will change. Use uh, cursor. Go to format, fill effects. This time I'm adding red color. The variant have selected the bottom one. Click OK. 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 Now notice here we got 67, 6, 48, 23. I'm comparing these two cells. And notice the 99, 99, 99, both are same. So I want to add different color. Again, go to condition, make sure this we need to select it when we are adding the new rule. The range we need to select. Go to conditional formatting, new rule. Use a format to determine which cells to format. Click B2, shift B12 equals to C2 to 50. Expand this one. Delete the dollar sign. Go to format to add the colors. Fill effects. This one I'm adding light ash color, gray color. Okay, okay, okay. So now we got 19 and got the gray, gray color. Now we need to apply um, condition to this C column also. First we need to select the range. Then go to home tab, styles, conditional formatting, new rule. Select the last one. C2, shift up to C2 of the range you have selected. If it's greater. Now B2, I'm comparing, shift, C12, expand this one, remove the dollar sign for the rows, go to format, if it's greater, fill effects, I want to display green color, this one variant I'm adding, okay, okay, see here? We got the green colors applied to these uh, cells. Now lesser, when we, uh, now we need to check the lesser values. Make sure selected, the range we need to select it. Conditional formatting, new rule. Use a format to determine which cells to format. Uh, C2 to C12, the range I have selected is lesser than B2, shift, B12, expand this one, remove the dollar sign, don't use arrows, use a cursor, otherwise the formula will change. Format, fill efforts, if it's lesser, I need to add red color, display red color, fill efforts, the variant, I have selected this one, okay, okay, see here. Now, when it's equal, I want to display both colors are same, gray color, conditional formatting, new rule, 
It's a formula. Selected B2, C2, L, C2, 2, C2, L is equals to B2, 2, B2, L. Expand this one. Remove the dollar sign for the row. Once again, I'm telling when you are doing this thing, use the cursor. Don't use arrow keys. We'll change the formula. Go to format, fill effects. The color is love. Light gray color I have chosen. Okay, okay, okay. That's it. And here we got the final output of our tutorial. Notice here 23 B cell 23 is greater. That's why it's showing green color. We have applied green color if the cell contains greater value compared with C cell. Suppose if I change this one to 1 to 1, which is greater than B cell, notice here it will become red color and this one is green color if the cell contains same i have given the light gray color if i am changing this 190 to 190 see here the 190c cell is greater than b cell that's why b cell contains the red color if i delete and here also i delete both cells are same if I add 23, 45. That's it. In this video tutorial, I have explained how to add styles using conditional formatting when we are comparing two columns. Let's say I add 100 here. Oh, I'm adding greater. That's it. Thanks for watching this video tutorial. Please subscribe, share and leave your valuable comment. We will catch you in my next video tutorial.